Hello and welcome to another video from Paraplays. Yes, another squad video. As you can see, the beauty of squad is sometimes underestimated. And in this video, I'm going to be having a look at smokes. It's not really a tactics video, more of a... Look how cool smokes are. No, it's not really. I'm going to be looking at smoke occlusion by throwing them into buildings. We know the devs have been working on this so that smoke doesn't go through walls doesn't go through roofs and things like that and it has been a massive massive improvement since the early days of the actual game so let's just get in and see how far that's come and whether there's any room for improvements at all so what we're going to do is we're going to be chucking some smoke grenades into some buildings and then we'll have a look and see if it actually comes out of walls roofs and windows so let's crack on and start throwing some smokes around Okay, so here we are. We're going to throw some smokes directly into this little building here, this little alcove as it were, and hopefully the smoke should stay within this perimeter. So I'm probably going to chuck a couple of these in here. Let's get the first one in. I do love all these little particle effects that are flying around. A lot of the times we actually don't notice this stuff. We in-game, we throw it straight away. Obviously, you get to notice the beautiful flames out there. So there we go. We've got some smoke in there now. Just give that chance to fill up a little bit. Smoking away. As you can see, it's actually coming out of the doorway very nicely indeed. Uh, there is a little bit by the looks of it coming out of that left on wall. A little bit of a strange effect there. I don't know whether that's the server. And as we come up to the roof, you can see unfortunately it is actually still coming through the roof, which is a shame really. I'm not quite sure if this is a bug or whether it's actually just this particular building. I will have to do some more tests, put some smoke into some other buildings and see whether it's the same on different maps. But compared to how this used to be, that really, really is good. And what we can do now is as well, we can actually put some in one of these rooms and see if the smoke actually comes out of these windows rather than coming out of the walls because there's two floors here, so it shouldn't, in theory, come out of the ceiling. So that smoke is now nice and thick. In fact, so much I've lost out where the, where's the door. <laughs> smoke, yes, doing what it's supposed to do, making it difficult for you. Right, as you can see, there's no smoke coming out. Apart from that doorway, which is the doorway we've just come out from, there's no smoke actually coming out of the front of this building. It would be nice if the smoke built up onto the ceiling and came out of the windows. Can you imagine? That would be just absolutely epic. So what we'll do is we'll chuck a couple in these top windows and then we'll run up and have a look and see whether the smoke is actually rising out of the roof of this building because obviously if you're getting in a fight and you're smoking it people are going to see which building you're fighting in which is a little bit of a disadvantage but maybe we're asking too much out of the engine at the minute because it certainly has been a massive improvement so you can see up at the top you can see it flickering away the flames from those uh, smoke grenades so let's get in there we'll go up top and see what we can see Right, so it looks like we've got a bit of a Turkish bath going on here, a little bit of a steam house. And let's go in and have a look. Now the bottom floor actually looked like white smoke. And from the top here, it looks actually looks like the building's on fire. Let's just go in and see whether that smoke has changed. This definitely looks like black, sm <coughs> black smoke. Black smoke. Can't see a bloody thing up here. Um, which is good because that's what smoke should do. Am I on the stairs? Yeah, I'm on the stairs here. Yeah. So I can't see a bloody thing up here, so... It seems to be that the smoke is black. I don't seem to remember us having uh, white and black coloured smoke. I know there are coloured smokes, blue, red and white for the squad leaders. But very interesting indeed, and it looks like it really does work. It just needs a little bit of tweaking. Anyway, follow squadettes and squadites. This has uh, just been a really quick video, just having a look at the smoke occlusion. Nothing more, nothing, nothing more to it really. I probably will do some videos on tactics for smoke because a lot of times people just chuck smoke down for absolutely no reason. And even when you're on the attacking team, I notice people throw smoke right next to you. You can't see a bloody thing. Yes, it's good if you're retreating and everything, but it means that the enemy can get in closer and you can't shoot them, etc, etc. So there are uses and times when smoke is useful and times when you really should just keep it in your in your pouch and uh, leave it there. Anyway, thanks for watching. I've been Paraplayers. Subscribe, thumbs up and all that bollocks. And I shall see you in the next squad video. Thanks for watching.
，拜拜。Queen and country. Hoorah!